Hey, 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 you guys, girl, this hair. <laughs> um, It's wash weekend. I guess I'll wash my hair tomorrow. I will detangle today, but girl, I want to come on cam because, yeah. <laughs> Let's move this stuff out the way. So I was at my local Brookshire's, which is a grocery store, um, and I was there to pick up um, some prescription and right next to the prescription was a huge box of stuff that said clearance sale clearance and so I'm like okay I saw a couple of like a lot of perm boxes child a lot of perm boxes I saw some hairspray and then I started to see some olive cholesterol some natural hair products I'm like hold up I look down the bin said one to two dollars two dollars I'm like oh no nah. two dollars I said, Jamie, go, go get me a buggy. <laughs> so I'm gonna show y'all what I got. And I'm not I'm not kidding you. Two dollars each. Do not sleep on your grocery store for hair products. Um, when I was in Phoenix, I would always get some banging hair products at my lower Albertsons. Um, what else would I Walgreens? That basically you don't necessarily have to find products that are on sale at like your Sally's or a beauty supply store. Baby, when I tell you I paid less than $20 for all of these products, girl, let's just get into it, okay? A lot of stuff I got double each. Let's get into in no particular order. I purchased the Coconut Water OGX Conditioner. Now, I've done a review on this product before. It's okay. For $2, I love it again. Um, It's okay. Um. It does have like a light coconut smell. I do like the um, slip that it gives me on my hair. But yeah, check it out if you haven't already. And I'm gonna try my best to link the cards or the reviews for this particular product in the cards, excuse me. So again, OGX conditioner, coconut water. Also by OGX, which I haven't tried before, is the Orchid Oil, Fate Defying Orchid Oil. Hold on. This says sulfate free, but this one doesn't. Hmm. Anyway, Fate Defying Orchid Oil Conditioner with UVA, UV, UVB sun filters. Interesting. Interesting. Let's see what this doesn't really have. Has like a, a perfumey type of fragrance, but not like the coconut water where you can really smell it. So again, both of these are by OGX, okay? Now, let's get into some hairsprays that I bought. Now, that's what I had originally had in my hand. This particular store, again, this is Brookshaw's, which is a grocery store that's common out in the South. So they had a couple of Cantu products I'd never tried before. So I got like, I had in my hand two different types of Cantu products that were only two. No, they were $8.99 each. I was okay with that until I saw all of this and I dropped those Cantu products. Anyway, y'all, Twisted Sister 30 Second Curl Spray, Coconut, Avocado, and Almond Oils. Now, I've tried products by Twisted Sister before. There was this other, it was like a, let me, okay, hold on. Um, that's okay. Normally, I like a misting spray. That smells good. Um, They had like a coconut, I believe it was like a coconut-y, coconut girl, that's not even a word. It was like a coconut spray which i love and i can't find that anymore that was years ago when i was using it but i'm going to try this out and i think i will do a review on this product i know i'm behind on reviews but i'm going to do a review on this one yeah i am staying along with the sprays we got cantu shea butter combat curl next day curl revitalizer for natural coils curls and waves this right here now to me, this is something for like, cause it says combat curls, curl revitalizer. So if you have a wash and go, um, like give me Jerry curl. <laughs> so this is really gonna be for JB cause I typically like to use some type of mousse or something. I'm gonna spread it on my hand and see what it feels like. It smells like it smells like curl activator type of scent. You know what I mean? 
yeah, it has that type of fragrance to it. Let me just push it up here. But I feel like this product would be good for all it says it here for type two waves, type four coils, and type three curls. Yep. So JB hair is coily, and I typically use a mousse gel leave-in conditioner, and I have the sponge. I know the sponge with all the holes in it, and I apply it and make little coils on his hair. I'm gonna try to use this on his hair. Okay. Now we're gonna get into another pro. Oh, girl, I forgot about this one. <laughs> <laughs> the Aunt Jackie's Curl La La Defining Curl Custard. Okay, I have a review on this one too. This is um, ooh, this is almost like a what well, is a custard? Yeah, it's a custard. It's thick. You see that curl custard consistency? Can I help you? Do you need help? What do you want, JB? Oh. I'm, I'm, give me five minutes. Give me five minutes. Oh. That's what you gotta do. So, um, I have a review on this too. This right here is good for... So, in my opinion, this would be good for a wash and go base along with a gel. Especially if you are in the 4A, 3B, 3C category system. I don't remember what I, what style I used. I'm reading the instructions, you guys. I do remember the style I used, bouncy waves across. So this type of product is not going to necessarily give you definition unless you pair it with another product. So I wouldn't necessarily use it solely to do a twist out, a braid out, or you know what I mean? But it would be great for, um, as a base for permanent sets and stuff like that. Again, to give you soft, bouncy curls. All right, y'all. So another product that I'm really am thinking about doing a review on is this Hollywood Beauty Olive Oil Shine Moisturizer. I have never seen this product before by Hollywood Beauty. Now, I, I'm pretty sure that, you know, they have had this around for a while. I may be wrong, but it says it contains vitamin E, olive oil, shine extracts, help to restore shine to dull, lifeless hair that has been damaged by chemical process. And okay, Hollywood Beauty, shake well and apply to palms of hands, massage evenly through hair. So this is a leave-in conditioner, okay? Oh, that smells good. That smells good. So yeah, I will be reviewing this. So do expect a review on this. And last but not least, stand on the Hollywood Beauty Baby. When I saw this, I was like, $2? <laughs> I'll have two of those, please. We have the olive oil cholesterol. You guys know you've been following me for a while. I am a stickler. I love cholesterol. And then I love to apply heat and leave it on for a good 30 minutes. It makes your hair so soft. Two of these. So again, $2 each. Look at this. $2 each. $2 each. Do the math. Less than $20. Don't sleep on it, girl. Don't, don't sleep on it. So expect reviews for the Twisted Sister 32nd and the Hollywood Beauty Shine Moisturizer. Now, I did purchase another Cantu product that I shared on my community page. That's gonna be the first review I'm coming out with. That is going to be the Cantu, I think it's a protein guava deep conditioner. But the one thing I like about all of these products that I am doing a review on, I could technically review that protein and this and knock it out within 24 hours because I can use this as a leave-in. I can use this as a spray the next day and it won't, none of these will um, affect the other product if that makes sense. So that's it, you guys. I'm rambling now. Thank you so much for watching and thank you as always to all of my new subscribers. Take care. Bye.